Hello everyone and welcome to this tutorial. In this video we will talk about the issue when the URL has an internal link with no anchor text, why it is important, how to check and how to fix the issue. What is it? The a HTML element or anchor element with its href attribute creates a hyperlink to web pages, files, email addresses, location in the same page or anything else a URL can address. The issue appears when the URL has at least one outgoing internal link with no anchor text. This represents a missed opportunity to provide additional information about the target page to search agents, which could have an impact on the page's ability to rank for relevant search queries. Any of the example links below would trigger the issue. An anchor with no text, an anchor with empty spawn but no text, an anchor with other attributes but no text. And here is the right example. How to check the issue? For sure you can look into the code of each and every page of your website separately and look for the missing text in your anchors, however it is much more convenient to scan your website with our site checker site audit tool and get the list of all the issues in terms of technical SEO, including the link with no anchor text. Just click on the issue and you will get the list of all the URLs that have it and the exact line in code where the issue is located. There is also another way to look into the all internal links by clicking on the URL and heading to the linking section. There you will see all the internal and external links without an anchor text. How to fix the issue? We recommend reviewing missing anchor text and adjusting the links to add useful and relevant content. Depending on the specific issue, you may be able to fix several pages at once if the link in question is used as a template for lots of pages on the website. Here are a few tips from Google on what to avoid when writing anchors for links. Avoid writing generic anchor tags like page, article or click here. Avoid using tags that is off-topic or has no relation to the content of the page linked to. Also, avoid writing long anchor text, such as sentences or a short paragraph of text. And the last but not the least, avoid creating unnecessary links that don't help with the user's navigation of the site. That was it for today, thanks so much for watching the video, if you enjoyed it hit the like button and subscribe to our channel and if you still have any other questions, feel free to reach out to our support which is support at sidechecker.pro. See you in the next videos.